If you or someone you know suffers from arthritis, lupus, psoriasis, or some other autoimmune disease, you know they're most likely taking medications that can unfortunately come with a lot of side effects. Well, our next guest says there is an alternative. Joining me now is Dr. Eric Udell. He is a naturopathic physician, and he's also the founder of Arizona Natural Health Center to tell us about some natural treatments for autoimmune disease. Thanks for being with us. Yes. I couldn't be farther on the spectrum. Psoriasis, and then you have, you know, something paired with like MS. What is autoimmune disease exactly? It's, it's amazing, right? So autoimmune diseases are a family of diseases. Our immune system protects us from infection and disease under normal circumstances. But when we develop an autoimmune disease, it starts to attack healthy cells in our body. And that's what relates all these different diseases. But autoimmune disease can affect virtually any part of the body, which is why you can have a disease like psoriasis that attacks the skin or something mm -hmm. called Hashimoto's thyroiditis, which attacks the thyroid gland, or more systemic diseases like multiple sclerosis, which attacks the central nervous system, rheumatoid arthritis, which which attacks the joints, lupus, which attacks really almost anywhere and often multiple areas at once, mm -hmm. and even something called Sjogren's syndrome, which is getting more attention now, which attacks those glands in the body that secrete kind of our normal secretions, like tears from the eyes or saliva in the mouth. And there's so many people who go on a cycle. They go to the doctor, they have pain, they get a prescription. So it's kind of westernized medicine, if you will. What are the current conventional ways that we are treating autoimmune? So how how we treat these diseases somewhat depends on the exact disease, but to make a general rule of thumb, there's three major classes of medications we use. There's anti-inflammatory medications like steroids or even things like NSAIDs, ibuprofen, Advil, etc. There's immunosuppressants and then even chemotherapy drugs. So often we have to resort to very powerful drugs to get these diseases under control. And how do natural treatments uh, for autoimmune disease work? I know you brought some examples there on the table. I did. So, you know, the great news is that natural medicine really has a lot to offer people with autoimmune disease. So first of all, there's lifestyle factors like diet and exercise. And so we brought some great looking dark leafy greens and some bright colored berries because these kinds of foods have very anti-inflammatory properties. They have lots of antioxidants and so they can really help both prevent autoimmune disease as well as manage and control the symptoms of autoimmune disease. But what I really want to talk about today is something that probably the viewers are less aware of. It's a lesser known therapy called homeopathy that really can have remarkable results with autoimmune disease. And a few points I wanna hit on with homeopathy. First of all, it's extremely non-toxic and therefore safe for all patient populations, infants, nursing and pregnant mothers, you know, seniors, really anyone can use it. And it doesn't interact with medications we're taking. So we can work with people whether they haven't begun conventional treatment or they're already taking conventional medications. Two, homeopathy addresses the underlying cause of the disease, in this case, autoimmune disease. When we do it well, we actually can slow down and often stop the immune system's attack on our healthy cells and actually eliminate the underlying disease process and therefore get rid of the symptoms in a, in a long-term sort of way. Other interesting things are it has strong anti-inflammatory properties. So when a lot of people come in to see us, really what they're suffering from is inflammation and what's causing their pain and discomfort is inflammation. And homeopathy can reduce inflammation often quite rapidly, either by itself or together with other medications. And then the last point I wanna come back to is about its lack of side effects with other medications. So we're able to work with people who haven't yet started conventional medication mm -hmm. and would like to try something natural first, as well as people who are already taking conventional medication but aren't getting the results thereafter. They're either not getting results or not complete results and they still don't have the quality of life that they're really looking for. And homeopathy again is? Homeopathy is the use of various natural substances in this very specific way. Okay. First of all, it's based on the principle like cures like. So what we're looking for is to find a medicine whose properties in a healthy person are similar to the symptoms that the person who's sick right now is experiencing. And two, we use very small doses. So in using these very small doses, we avoid side effects, but when we're very accurate in picking and choosing the appropriate homeopathic medicine for the person, then we stimulate a healing response and the underlying disease process starts to improve. So in this case, the autoimmune process 
begins to go down and people have less problems with their immune system attacking their own healthy well, cells. Someone, someone suffering from autoimmune um, disease, can they pair the two? Can you use natural treatment and conventional treatment together? Absolutely. We can do them together or alone and oftentimes when we start with people they're already on medications but as, as their health improves over time we're able to slowly reduce the medications and often get people off of medications altogether and in remission. I mean, this is stuff you can pick up at your grocery store on your way home. I mean, Absolutely. very simple things to help at least start the process and, of course, get the dialogue going with your own physician. Absolutely. All right. Well, we appreciate you so much, Dr. Udell. And you guys are offering a special, um, a special offer for our Sonoran Living viewers. All nine physicians at Arizona Natural Health Center offers a fifth a free, a free 15 minute consultation to discuss your medical conditions. And this is ranging everything from colds and flus to seasonal allergies, mental health issues, cancer, and complex chronic conditions. And this includes children and adults. Arizona Natural Health Center, it is located at 1250 East Baseline Road. That is in Tempe. If you'd like to make an appointment, give them a call at 480-456-0402. You can also find uh, information about health tips and other useful tools on their website, aznaturalhealth.com. Dr. Udell, thank you so much. Thanks for having me.